He's Aussie. Now we're going to remove these shines using the diamond moon bits. Remember you guys, we're knocking them out of the park today as well too. What are they saying? Hi from Lakewood, Colorado. Hello, Kelsey. Hello. Hello from Fiji. Hi from Fiji. Back in Spanish. Nicole Kidman. Kidman. Love Nicole Kidman. Everybody knows that. Um, love Thor and love. And his brother is Australian too. Yeah, isn't his name Liam? Something like that. David Yeah, yeah. Both of them are Aussie. They're both. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. How was Disneyland? It was very, very tiring. Kel uh, Kelsey. Lena and I walked roughly 50 miles, which is around 25 kilometers in three days. Lena said she walked so much, her pinky toe fell off. Bruised. Bruised. But she survived. And you guys want to know something that we did? So they were talking about um, how long the wait times are at Universal, especially for the Hagrid's motorbike adventure. It was listed at 75 minutes. And we were like, okay, Lena, this is the last ride that we have not gone on because we have a schedule and we go to a theme park. We don't even enjoy it. We're like, we need to do all the rides. So it was listed at 75 minutes and we were like, okay, this will be our last ride. We've been on all of them already. We did um, the Harry Potter journey of Hogwarts or whatever it's called twice. So we went on it and it was 75 minutes and we only did 37, 34. And then we were like, you know what? They're bluffing. They're probably just doing that so that we people will go home. And we went on again and it was 37 minutes. It was a three minute longer wait. What are people saying, Kelsey? Yeah. You know what size bit you use when you're just buffing the natural nail? I don't understand the question. Can you read the question, please? Mm -hmm. I'm at a restaurant eating lunch while she missed. I don't even have a earphone. <laughs> That's okay. Educate the children. Educate the world about the phalanges. What am I going to eat for dinner? What am I eat for dinner? my lunch somebody on instagram was like how is the food at disney world and i was like horrible of course theme park food is disgusting and expensive and then lena was like look green eggs and ham and i was like i don't know what that is but that sounds interesting is it good um it tasted like spinach mixed with egg that's why it was green it over tater tots and i was like can i have pepper please because this tastes like nothing <laughs> it was ten dollars for a plate too was it a lot? Yeah, I didn't even finish it. Do you know how much a bottle of uh, water is at Disneyland? Mm -hmm. Disney World? Like 350, 375 plus tax. Love, love your ring. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And probably not very good. We did have butter beer, and I didn't care for it. I thought it tasted like a flat cream soda. Do you like cream soda, Kelsey? Uh, yeah. What about sarsaparilla? Never no. Press. Do you guys have? Have you guys had sarsaparilla before? Look at that shape. She is a ballerina. And they were actually like pretty relaxed. Universal Studios was pretty relaxed about the mask. There wasn't too too many people being really pushy about it, but at Disney World, they were like on you all the time. In between bites, sir, in between sips. So they want you to wear your mask in between bites and in between sips. On the plane too. Oh, has somebody posted the website? Let me pin it, please. Please, 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 please post. And the people were taking pictures with masks on and they would go like, smile. <laughs> I do that sometimes. What? I'm just like out and about. And I smile underneath my mask and I can't just... Really? I took my mask off really quickly to take a picture. I was like, Lena, hurry before they say something. 
before they escort me out of the web, out of the, uh, out of the website, out of the uh, park. But I'm not gonna fly across the country and not take a good picture. Did they yell at you? Yes, but it was worth it. Are you gonna spend like it's so expensive to fly out there? Get a hotel, park tickets. I wanted a good picture. I deserved a good picture. Like, give me a second. Yeah. It was only for a few seconds too, anyway. Beautiful. Look at that. Let's do the next one. Oh, and I forgot I would talk with a British accent too. <laughs> like all of a sudden, because they they're nicer to you. Really? Yeah. And then one girl was like, where are you guys from? And we're like, Arizona. <laughs> she was all interested. You know what was our first ride? It's a small world. You don't know what it's a small world is, Kelsey? Oh my gosh. It's like the, the most cheesiest ride ever. But it's so cute. It's all these little dolls that think, it's a small world after all. I think we do <laughs> And they're like dressed up from their countries. That's kind of cute. There was only one American one, I think, dressed up like a, like a Cherokee, not a Cherokee. Yeah, like a Cherokee. That made me sad. They needed more American. Um, this is our express technique, my dear. We have grown, we have improved, and evolved the technique. So this is our express technique. I hope you enjoy it. My favorite ride is Haunted Mansion. That was okay. Um, no, not at all. And I've been on it so many times that it's lost its charm, I think. But it's very nostalgic for a lot of people because it is such an old ride. Like Pirates of the Caribbean, I didn't like that. I don't like that ride. I think that ride is so boring. But we did go on Splash Mountain and Lena was like, you're gonna get wet, Max. And I was like, hopefully it won't be too bad. And I did buy myself a poncho that's like a $12 trash bag. And I did get wet, but I had to go on it because it is uh, gonna be closing soon because they're gonna uh, change it because it is not publicly correct now. I wanna go. What? To where you went. Disney World? Yeah. Well, go now before it gets hot and humid. Really? Can you imagine being- I hate being hot and like sticking in. Can you imagine 100 degrees and it's humid, 100% precipitation? No. That's why I go in January. Oh, how I miss you and your life, Max. Glad you had fun, but glad you're back too. Thank you. Splash Mountain will get you wet. Antonia Cubino Wilson is here. What Susie had a live video? What was it about? It's Susie. Susie, I don't know. Is it Susie from Canada? Yes, Splash Mountain will get you wet. And I, we requested to sit in the back and they would not honor our request. Oh, Soren is fun. I like when you're like flying over the tropical area. It smells tropical, it's nice. Sawadika! Kun Mak! Sawadika! Pumrakun! Sawadika! Well, are you glad I'm back? We did go on the Frozen ride twice, though. That's Have you ever it. Even seen the movie? No. But the ride is so pretty. You have to watch the movie for Okay, let's bake this for one minute, you guys. Oh, I already addressed it. I already came for that. I thought that was so silly. I feel like that company that started that is just doing that as a marketing tactic because they're probably plummeting in sales. I'm glad you're back. I missed the videos. Oh, thank you. Everybody knows that the 123GO system is 100% soft gel. I'm so glad to be back as well, too. And I mean, it's kind of sad that, you know, Companies have to uh, 
use such a low ball tactics to try to derive sales from other companies. But you know what? It's the nature of the beast. And you know, all I can do is feel bad for them. It really is sad, I agree. I love Expedition Everest. Are you ever coming to New Jersey? I don't have any plans yet. Yes. Huh? With the cubicle one? It's in Labyrinth of the London room. There should be a bunch up there, there's not. I don't know. Where's Antonio? Was the class successful? Of course, all the students were incredible, and I hope they all had a great time. It was so much fun. Everybody was laughing and learning, and you know, we just had a really great time. Everybody, um, I think, really enjoyed it. And we will, are looking forward to having our next class in Florida, January 2022. Where's the next class? That's um, no, the next class is actually going to be in Texas. We were oh, I forgot, sorry. <laughs> I got all excited because you liked and commented. I love you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. So you guys, you know what about the, the the nails being made out of plastic and gel? I think, you know, we shouldn't pay it any attention, but you know, if you want to express your opinion towards them, you're more than welcome to. How do you keep the nails from getting hot when curing? Um, apply the gel thinner. And you can also use the 99 second timer on our machine as well too. And the, what that does is it builds up the power of the lamp so that way the heat is not so strong, AKA the crunk. It was so incredible be able to see the girls live and hang out with, with the students and share and, you know, just make the world a smaller place. That is right. Pay no, small, pay no attention to the small money people. So I'm using the seven piece robot set again to go in and blend in the cuticle area of the floor lounging. Yeah, and to make a video about it just dedicated to that is really, really... I mean, stay in your lane, girl. Your products are amazing. And you know, one thing about me is I never, ever, ever talk about other brands or companies or other um, people on my videos. Never, ever, ever. I stay in my lane and they should stay in theirs. But, unfortunately, when you're desperate for sales, you do what you gotta do, so... As Mr. T says, I pity the fool! So now I'm using the long bit, also in the seven piece drill bit set, to go in and nicely blend out that cuticle. The thing is, they never named other companies, but they say they had their own full coverage tips at the same time. It was surreal to hear them say this. It's quite sad, actually. It's because another company was telling everybody that to not buy full coverage gel nails because they're not gel, they're plastic, and this and that, and just bashing. Not just, you know, all companies that, that sell gel, full coverage gel nails. I mean, I'm not the only one, but I mean, I take offense for all the companies that sell this too because I don't go around, you know, comparing my products or anything like that. But if you gotta use those tactics, I mean, I feel bad. I really do. Hey, Matt, glad to see you back. Love your bracelets. Thank you, I got them at Disney World. What is this shape in Ballerina. This is Miss Ballerina. Nicole is here. Hi from the Netherlands. Hi from the Netherlands.
I've had nothing but a good experience with your service and your products. Anyone who tries to say anything negative as a motive, I turn them right off. I go by my experience. Hashtag pink on That is true. And you know what? I don't think we're malicious people. Hi from Chicago. Hi from Chicago. Let's remove the dust. Now we're ready to paint. Where is the glitter, Kelsey? Here it is. We're going to use <laughs> Precious Minerals number 44, which is a really beautiful, really super light, iridescent, hollow glitter. And we're just going to do it over the whole nail. And then I'm going to use, I did use earlier my blender brush, but I lost it. I don't know where it went. So I'm just going to use my liner brush and feather the glitter back really gently. Lucy Frank is here. She's living the dream out in Acapulco. Oh, Antonia, you should fill Lucy Frank in on all the drama that's going on. What a way to start 2021. How much would a set like this cost? You know, it's really hard for me to say you should charge this much or that much. I just suggest you charge the same as you do um, your acrylic or gel nails because that's pretty much what it is, but it's just pre-made. Let's bake that, Kelsey, 30 seconds. These nails last until you remove them. I'm trying to remember when you put mine on. Huh? I mean, I how long it was. A long time ago, like at the beginning of December. You probably had those nails on for like six or eight weeks. They're black set. That's crazy. And that's how good they stay on. Now we're going to do the second coat. Hi, thanks for joining us today. Find that glitter towards the back. This is Precious Minerals number 44. And this is actually the same color I used on my mom. You guys will get to see tomorrow her set. Her set is also very simple, very clean looking. She's just wearing the XXL Stiletto Ombre. And um, I modified the shape to be more oval -esque. Okay, bake that kills. And then we're gonna add some 3D white butterflies on Kelsey. Really? Oh my gosh, that company doesn't even have a chemist. Because acrylic is not manufactured in the state of California. I'm going to use press on gel and clear to adhere my butterflies. paper flower set so I can't remember exactly what number they are but if you visit the website they're there just look up paper flowers so what do you call
This is the regular ballerina shape. And we have over 60 different styles, so visit the website. I'm pretty sure there's something for you. Too many lengths, too many styles, and more to come. Production on the 5XL square and 5XL stiletto mold is underway, so those will be available in spring 2021. The longest full coverage gel nails in the world, hands down. These nails are very, very long, very, very stripper-esque, and I'm very excited about them. My Disney World bracelets that I got. These were expensive too. I was looking at the receipt, they were $10 each, and I was like, geez. Yeah, poquito. There's one, two more. It's nice. It's really nice. It's going to stay in a crystal like that. Mm -hmm. that butterfly. Like Mariah Carey. Mm -hmm. I have to stop at the swap. What for? They know my rosary and using it. Oh my gosh, that's going to take forever. I love their churros. Ugh, I hate going to the swami. My boyfriend loves it. I don't like it. I just like their churros. Ugh. Oh, I'd rather shoot myself in the foot than go to the swami. Huh? How long is it gonna take you? Like half an hour, maybe. Go now then. Are you gonna go over? Huh? No. Why don't you go tomorrow? So now I'm playing gummy gel where I'm gonna put my rhinestones. Now let's apply shiny gel. Over the entire phalange. She said, why did he say he was getting his browser set? Yes. <laughs> at the swamp meet. Let's get our bling tool ready. Um, this case is so obnoxious. Which one? The one on your phone. Because it's puppy. What? The girls will answer that question for me. Because I just answered it earlier today. Please, please, can we have all the links in New Zealand? Um, contact your distributor in New Zealand and they'll be able to further assist you, Mama. No, you can order direct from enocouture.com and we ship all over the world. Next, I tried your happy joke. I love it. Isn't she great? Oh, this one's point back. I won't point back. She is fabulous. Throw me jellies every And a bag of chips. Are you the churro queen, Kelsey Dog? Mm -hmm. Especially with the strawberry filling. No, the churro that Disney World did not have any kind of filling or anything. They were really pushing. Well, is that Jack in the box or actually surprising? They are. 
they are I've had them. Yeah, but it's like, go to Jack and Fox Woods. I'm like, I'm not getting to Jack and Fox. Jack and the Crack. That's a good kind of habit to have. A little bit. One more diamond. There. No more. Stop next. Contain yourself. Let's bake that, you guys. On the edge of glory. Bye. See you tomorrow. Don't you work tomorrow? I'm coming in for my check. And then we're going to do a coat of shiny over everything. Bye bye. She's going to grab everything, make sure she's nice and sealed. What? Really? And here we are rushing your nails. I know. It's because we've told him to set it, but I told him that's going to be Did Victor leave? Yeah. I'm going to be sitting here. Waiting. Let's bake these for one minute. What does everybody say, Kelsey? Time to party really? <laughs> you gonna turn up tonight, Kelsey Delk? Tomorrow. Why not two days in a row? Because I cannot drink anything without being hungover. Like I can have one glass of wine and be hungover. Really? So I don't drink very often. Mm -hmm. So I'm just gonna do it tomorrow. Yeah, like Kelsey says, like I don't drink very often, but when I do, I get wasted. Not wasted at all. Just literally, I can't. Are you like, hold my hair? No. What do you think you're for dinner? I don't know. I think I'm gonna make enchiladas. That's coming down. I wanna try yours. I really did. You should bring some of You know how to cook, Kelsey? Huh? You know how to cook? Yeah. Really? Enchiladas? Are they frozen? No. How do you make frozen? Kelsey's like, I buy them at the store and I just pop it in the oven. Casserole style. I don't like them all that. I make my rolls. Casserole style. That's like a tamale pie then. Bye bye. I, I kind of like I like fry mine a little bit the tortilla and then I. Mm -hmm. The tortilla. That's how I make some white. What? Good, okay. Tortilla with guacamole. I make really good. I still want to try. It's hard because my husband doesn't allow leftovers when I make them. I've never tried Marissa's food. And supposedly, I mean, great for him. Ooh. Yeah, I've heard Marissa makes a bomb tomorrow fish. I hate fish. What are the girls saying? We're ready for you. Some kiroko oil. Aren't they? Oh, thank you. And they're American made. <laughs> with jalapenos. Guacamole with jalapenos. Guacamole with jalapenos? With fried tortillas? Is that how you say it? I don't know. Can I have guacamole without jalapenos? <laughs> there we have it, you guys. Guacamole and jalapeno nails for Kelsey Delk. Let's get some hard light, though. One second. 
Ooh, come through Cinderella nail realness. Do you guys love it? Super simple, super cutesy bootsy. Perfect for every day. Very easy to replicate as well too. With the little butterflies and everything. Well, my loves, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for making enailcouture.com the number one nail brand in the world and for supporting American companies. I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Stay safe, you guys.